music I'm creating right now is like a fine wine someone forgot about for years. And I really haven't released an album in my entire life. I released five songs as an EP. What I'm working on now is the culmination of 15 years of kind of experimenting in the craft, trying different things, wearing different outfits. I actually started, you know, a poet. One day, a friend of mine encouraged me to put the, some of the poetry to the chords I knew, the three chords, A minor, E minor, D minor. I had those three chords and I started just applying my poetry to it. And then I realized I was essentially unlocking like a new level on the guitar with every song, learning a new skill on the guitar with every song, learning more, you know, my arpeggiation better, getting my rhythm better. And through time, these things were just kind of happening through practice. There's a lot of friends of mine who uh, might not exactly know what I do exactly. Some know I sing, but some think I only sing in Armenian. Some know I paint, but they've assumed it's a hobby. I'm one of those few that the pandemic actually helped to bring my affairs in order and understand that everything I need is essentially, you know, here under this roof, uh, under the space that I turn into my studio. Now, you know, I have this space now, but in the past I've, I've been in Armenia, I've created studios there. Some of my friends, you know, call me the studio gypsy. I essentially build and break down studios wherever I go. Um, when the war started, I really did not want to create anything. I didn't want to do anything. It was, uh, I was starting to question everything I create, every figure I draw, every form I, I think up, uh, the, the lyrics in my songs, some of the subject matters uh, to me seem like, you know, futile compared to the, the actual problems of the world right now. And, you know, who might have sing about some silly breakups and you know, uh, upset at the man and this and that, when, when the reality is, is there's, there's people uh, dying under fire and under drone attacks. But unfortunately, I don't understand what you're saying. Banners and banana phones are calling it a metaphor. The ones who wear the hats to have their say. They'll play it like the penny stock, sell a soul with every rock, but leave a little sand so we can pray. Cause there's a poor child can't sleep tonight. There's a Child can sleep tonight. Phonies on the merry go round about the phonies. It's a carnival you never want to go. See, the clowns are juggling all this happiness they're smuggling, trying to make us think they'll never really know. There's a poor child can sleep tonight. There's a Child can sleep tonight. One for the blood, and three for the bread. There's 
there's a reason why no one ever heeds what he said. Twenty-three years is just a bit too long to learn that every bit of peace is just a little bit wrong. And there's a poor child can sleep tonight. There's a poor child can sleep tonight. There's a war child can sleep tonight. There's a war child can sleep tonight. It's very good of you to ask, but unfortunately I don't understand what you're saying. It's very good of you to ask, but unfortunately I don't understand what you're saying. It's very good of you to ask, but unfortunately I don't understand what you're saying. It's very good of you to ask, but unfortunately I don't understand what you're saying. It's very good of you to ask, but unfortunately I don't understand what you're saying.